It's Presley at ActoGames.com here, and welcome to Science Sunday. Today we're making a non-Newtonian fluid called oobleck. So you might be asking, what is a non-Newtonian fluid? So first let's start about what a Newtonian fluid is. And a Newtonian fluid is a fluid like this water, where no, uh, if I stir it, no matter how hard or fast I stir it, it doesn't get any thicker or thinner. It is pretty easy to move around, and you can just stir it, and it doesn't really change the properties that much. And a non-Newtonian fluid is something that doesn't behave that way. And if you stir it, it either gets thicker or thinner the more you stir it or you compress it. So the non-Newtonian fluid we're going to make in day oobleck gets thicker when you stir it or agitate it. So much so it almost becomes a solid. So first we're going to show you how to make it and some cool things that it does. And then we're going to tell you why it does those things. So there's only two ingredients, water and cornstarch. So you need one part water and about one and a half parts cornstarch. So I would start with a cup of water and about half, about one and a half cup of cornstarch. So you have to mix it around a lot and keep mixing it until it gets thick. If it gets too thick, add more water. If it gets too thin, add more cornstarch. And you really have to start knowing when you start to get the, the right consistency because if there's really a right consistency and you have to add more of cornstarch if it gets too thin, more water if it gets too thick, and you have to keep mixing it until you can get the right consistency. So we'll see you when we've gotten our right consistency. So this is about the consistency you want it to be. So when you're just looking at it, it looks like a bowl of liquid, and when I drag my finger through it very slowly, it still looks like a liquid. But if I drag my finger through it really fast, you can see it kind of, it breaks up into little solid parts, which is really cool. So if you agitate it, it turns into a solid, but if you're just kind of messing around with it, it's a, li it's a liquid. And I find this really cool, like you can grab some of it and then it just leaks out of your hand like it's a liquid. And it's absolutely amazing. I love this thing. So I'm going to try and make a ball out of it and then I'm going to let it sit in my hand and let it melt. So it's a bit hard, tricky to make a ball because if you hold it for a second, melt. <laughs> so we should get a slow-mo of that. That'd be cool. So we're gonna grab it and we're gonna try and make a ball of it. You have to go fast. Oops, I got some oobleck out of the bowl. Yeah. It's gonna keep my attention off the ball. But one cool thing about oobleck is you grab it like a solid and let it leak back into the bowl if you spill some of it. So here's my shape. Whoa, that almost immediately just, wow. This thing's amazing. So as long as you're squeezing it or rubbing it, it's a solid, but as soon as you stop, it is a liquid and it's, ah, this, I really can't explain in words how cool this thing is. I definitely recommend making it for yourself and it's not hard at all. And then you can just have hours of fun just messing around with this, like rolling it up in your hands and, watching the ball immediately almost turn into a liquid. And it, it's just cool. Like you can have the stuff drip in your hand and squish it and it becomes like solidy. One of our science dreams is to have a giant tub of this because if you have a giant tub of it, you can run across it because the pressure of your feet pressing down on it is gonna make it a solid, but as soon as you stop, you start sinking into it like a liquid. And I think I might eventually just make a bath out of this stuff and run around on it. That would be really fun. So I hope that dream can be accomplished very soon. Like you can fill up a kiddie pool with it and run across it. Man, that would make for an epic pool party. Like the most epic pool party. Cause you could, if you stood, if you, if you kind of sat still, you could kind of sink into the water. But if you're running across it, boo, 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 you are actually running on a solid. So this is kind of how quicksand works, because if you just stand still in the quicksand, you'll sink. But if you try and get out, it becomes thicker and kind of holds you there, which is really interesting. Like you can make your own quicksand trips, pet quicksand traps here.
One of the cool things we've seen people do is they've put it on a speaker and they played kind of dubstepy music and then the oobleck kind of danced because the waves from the sound compressed it and then it and it popped and everything and it was awesome but we don't have a good speaker to try it out on so we're not gonna do that but you can definitely watch videos of people doing it and you can try it out yourself if you have a good speaker just don't do it on a speaker you want to keep so now let's talk a little bit about what's happening so cornstarch is really fine and when you put it in a bag even you can feel it's really fine the pieces are sort of jagged so they stick together really well and when you put them in water they sort of repel each other and they just take go apart and they're floating around in the water so when you put your hand slowly they can just get all get out of your way in your hand but if you do it too fast they don't have time to get out of the way and they kind of stick back together again but then when you leave it they slowly drift back apart and that's basically what's happening. Honestly, it's impossible to explain how cool this stuff is. You really need to mix it up and play with it yourself, although it is quite a mess. And this stuff, it, there's special ways to dispose of it before you play with it. Read up on how to dispose of it because you can't just pour it down the sink because it'll lock up like as a solid as it going down the sink and that'll just be a giant clog. So read up on the best ways to dispose of it so you don't have to deal with this big solid in there, your sink. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I smile. Bye! It's time to press the subscribe button. A subscribe button. A subscribe button. A subscribe button. Bye, 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 bye.